Hey, welcome to my Do It All series. This quest I'm going to be doing is the Scoundrel's Run. I'm going to do it on Reaper 1. First, we got to go talk to Rosie to pick it up. Uh, so what I'm going to start doing, uh, for anybody that is watching this video first, um, or has seen some of my other ones prior and now seen this video, I am going to start well I have been but I'm gonna start mentioning it in all my videos below uh, in the description on YouTube I'm posting times of all the objectives optional objectives and anything that I feel is really important um, so check it out you can click on the times it'll take you right to that point in the video you can skip around if you want if you already know the quest but you want to see how to do a puzzle or something like that um, so f feel free to look, uh, leave a comment too. Let me know if you like it. Okay, so we have not been to this quest entrance yet. It's all the way up there. So we have done this one, so we could talk to him and teleport out there. But just the sake of if this is the first time you're running any quest out here and you want to run to it, I'll show you. Nest is strategically placed to detect ships coming in and out of Three Barrel Cove. And I'll run backwards the whole way there if you want. <laughs> up all right now back to run to the quest So, Scoundrels Run, I, I couldn't tell you exactly how many times I've ran this quest. If I were to guess, I'd say under five times. So, I know the quest, but I might get spun around once or twice. We'll see. Maybe I'll uh, not get spun around at all. Um, I did peek at Wiki before I started the stream, and it's something that uh, there's two maps on Wiki. I I like to use usually the top map, usually works pretty well, but there's multiple levels in this quest and a couple turnarounds and stuff like that. So I clicked on the sep second map and took a few minutes to read it. I, I kind of like the way that that one, I think it explains it really well. So I will be peeking at that. I do have that set up on my side monitor. Alright, so here is the quest entrance. It now serves to separate pirate from peasant. Scoundrels run. So you're going to want a few inventory uh, slots free. Uh, I believe, believe it's five. So you have the ancient pedestal here. You can exit, so just be aware. Try not to do that. Sure, I suppose I'll call my hire. Okay, so let's head south first. Locked. The air around you swelters with the heat given off by unseen machinery. So 
There's mushrooms here. Now this door is locked until you activate those two runes. And we gotta find out what that is. I forget if that's the puzzle itself, the floor tile puzzle, or the puzzle wheels. But we'll figure it out. Adventure pack here. Alright, so now we're at the second floor. Which on the map kind of looks like the third floor, actually. On the second map that I'm peeking at at Wiki. The idol of Halox lay are nearby. You see, trapped in here. So, you want to get your whole party in here when you enter this. That way, you don't get trapped alone and possibly die by getting held by the rock elementals, earth elementals. Okay, so here are the legs. So, there's five pieces right claw, left claw, legs, head, and. I forget the other one. Neck? I forget what it is. Body, probably. <laughs> yeah, I jumped a little too late. Here's the floor tile puzzle. Here leads to the end of the drawbridge, then over the edge to the room below. That lowers the drawbridge. But you want to have the puzzle continue below. As you just heard, it sounded like a gate open, that's because it did. So there's rubble right here. Then the enchanted mosaic here leads up. I believe this is the door that opens. The second piece of the oh, tail, that's the last piece. Tail. Yep. You see how the puzzle continues down and goes there, opens the door up. Alright. So now we're on the bottom tier, and where Clanky is right here, this is the second tier and where the actual floor tile puzzle was, that was the um, top tier, third. If you're doing levels and tiers. Looks like we have more scorpion here. Last one, and darn it. There we go. Okay, so we're basically going to circle back up around to here where the floor tile was, and we're going to cross that bridge now. Alright, so you see we have already been here. Floor tile. So up ahead in a little bit there are going to be some traps. Um, some... One, I believe there's a box and the others you have to go through them or past them and get a lever 
valve to disable them. Alright, well, it's somewhere here. Maybe up ahead. Yep. Yeah, it's a fire trap. I believe it comes out of here. Okay, so up ahead there's going to be some fire traps. Which I can go two ways. Um, I continue going south, which is not the way we want to go. We want to go down here. So you know what? I am going to give myself a jump. So that way I can jump over them. You can time them, everything else. So let's see. Nope, I hit myself. Ooh, tricky, tricky. Of course, I stand in. The ground shakes. All right, right claw. That, that valve disables the traps. So all the fire traps are disabled. Minus the fire trap I disabled. The trap box. And I believe that's on traps. So we got aggression here. Another collectible. So there's the exit. We do not want to exit. Now we're back at the beginning. So you can hit the shrine um, or continue. It doesn't matter. Uh, let's see. Do we have to go down here? We don't, but I will. So from the beginning, if you head to the west, it's going to take you to the very bottom where the floor tile puzzle was. And you're going to have some night scorpions. Just want to try to explore it all. Starting to look familiar with the ladder there. See? Now we're back at bottom. Okay, we'll hit this part next. So, where the fire trap was, you, you had the trap box here with the, the chest there. Um, then we went south, and we could have went south again, but we ended up going east where all the fire traps were until I hit the valve right here. So instead of going down here, if I would have hit south and continued to here, there would be the wheels. The wheel puzzle. So that lever cannot be picked, just so you know. Alright, still can't open that up. Uh, okay, so I did get spun around. So what I probably should have did is when I was at the bottom of the tile puzzle I probably should have climbed up the ladder all the way and come down that way but I didn't see told you I'd get spun around once or so I said I might or something okay so basically where that gate was right here um, when I come through here it's gonna lead me around and down to that gate. So we're going to just go the back way. This is where I was talking about with the single trap and the trap box. And this is where we turned left with all the fire traps in the hall. So you're going to continue this way. And if you look 
on your left and your right sides. There's green, scorpion, blue, backwards up. And then you can go further up, and you can see the other two. Red is inverted J, purple is octo. So what this is going to do is open that up. I forget which one that one was. I think green was scorpion. Yeah, green scorpion. Yep, F. See? Opened up. Okay, so this is number four out of five. I'm just going to see where this takes me real quick. Okay. Yep. So this is the very top of the shaft. So, yeah. You could drop down here if you want. Oh, there's the other way you can get up here. Alright. I see. I see. So, when I took this turn and this turn, I could have just went north and jumped across. So from the beginning, basically you can come all the way down here and circle around and right to here. So that that's how I'm here. Just a little circle around. Alright, so our last piece is going to be to the left. The red name. The box. Alright, it's not the last piece. The locks lock box. Ah, uh, okay. The last piece is going to be to the left down here. Alright, so that valve... Ah, I see. Rusty gears squeal as several okay, so that opens the other gate. Gates. I see now. Collectible and collectible. So Okay, the key unlocks this. And another collectible. So as you can see, I have the, the idols in my inventory. So you need the inventory space. I just want to see something here. Let's see if the higher pulls that lever, if that will open this gate. I'm pretty sure it does. Yep. 
cool. Yep, and then I could just jump on down. Or I am down. Excuse me. I am on bottom. All right, lever's still locked. So now that we have all five pieces, reconstruct the idle. Yes. You have to click on it for each one. It's where my mouse is getting in the way. Like if I click here, nothing happens. I gotta actually click on the pedestal. Incomplete. Still locked, huh? So we got Onslaught. Three oh one Reaper XP, fourteen thousand four hundred eighty one heroic XP. That's the best bonuses that you can get according to Wiki. Sixteen minutes fifty eight seconds. Looking up real quick to see if I can see what that lever does. Hmm. Interesting. I'm wondering if you could use that key that I picked up on this to open up the gate here and that gate and that one. Maybe it opens all of them, some of them. Um, like before, I'm going to put it in the description uh, once I figure out if that lever does even anything. Um, I'll put it down in the description. So make sure you check out those descriptions. Uh, let's see what's what's going on there. And something like that I'll put probably at the bottom of the description. I'll, I'll first start with like all the objectives, the, the required objectives. Then I'll skip a space and put all the optionals. So it'll be one optional. Then I might put like notes with the times and stuff. So that will probably be the locked lever. And I'll let you know what's going on with it. Now we got double recall and get our end reward. Since the pirates first claimed the coal, it now serves to separate pirates Aww. from peasants. It's my rune arm shot. I stopped recalling. Alright, see what we get. Rosie. Mm, nothing that I'm going to want. Nope. Alright, my do it all series. That was the Scoundrel's Run. Don't forget in the description I'm going to put uh, what that lever does. Uh, once I find out. So please read those, comment, follow, and or subscribe. Thank you very much. Later.